for God so loved the world, what gave his only begotten Son, whosoever believe in him shall not perish, but have a lasting life. For God not send his Son to the world, to condemn the world, but the world through him might be saved. He believes on him is not condemned, but he believeth not is condemned already, because he are not believed in only begotten Son of God. Welcome to England, brother. I am not first day here, thank you. Uh, welcome to Braintree. Thank you. Uh, why are you doing this for uh, the gospel? For glory of God because, and because Christ command go and preach gospel to all creature. He believe and baptized should be saved. He believe and not should be damned. Says the word of God in Mark 16, I think. And you come from Lithuania to tell English people about the gospel? Uh, when I came to here, uh, actually, yeah, last time I came from uh, Lithuania with to see brothers and of course to do will of God, so yes, similar. Where are you heading for now, brother? Oh, anywhere where there's people around and gospel can be preached in a busy place or anywhere God's Spirit guide me or leads me. And you're heading towards? Heading. heading. You're going to Ipswich? By God's grace, I need to check the maps, I'm thinking to by god grace not sure actually don't want night where do you sleep uh anywhere where god provides nice place to sleep by god grace have you got much money with you uh it's enough it's not money is not more important I have 10 pounds which brother gives me in, in faith have so christians been have christians been helping you yes if christians helps very people is show the support for ministry of gospel of Jesus Christ, yes. And how long will you be in England? By God's grace, not sure, but I think about two weeks. By God's grace, maybe longer. It depends from ever and it's about God, you know. Man, man God corrects man's ways, so how can man understand his ways? Proverbs says, you know, and God directs man's ways, so how man can understand. What is your main message? about God's holiness, God's uh, righteousness, man's sin, man falling, God's love toward man through Jesus Christ, to die through death of Jesus Christ and through that is receiving remissions of sins through his blood, about eternal judgment, about hell, fire, about hell, about heaven, about everlasting life, about Love, joy, peace in God's kingdom about new heavens, new earth, and what God will create all things new without pain and sorrows, and will be amazing joy in God's kingdom. What people will be kings and priests in God's kingdom in Jesus Christ, and will rule forever in Jesus' name, power, and what Jesus Christ is name of all names. And it's no escape from that. It's reality, guys. How long have you been a Christian? Uh, nearly three years, and. And like Christian, I felt still like baby Christian because Bible speaks about Christian baby, Christian child, and full age when it's man who can be teacher. Even I try to teach people, but I still felt as baby. But I believe God teach me. So near now a Christian near three years, but still feel like growing and really weak in faith. Uh, how old are you? How old are you? Oh, but in real, in flash, I'm 28 years. Do you want to become a pastor? By God's grace, yeah, but I don't feel worth of that, so it's so another thing. What about evangelist? Yeah, I'm already evangelist. So, I think it's a good job. Bible says, be good soldier for you, Jesus Christ. I uh, really would like to be soldier. I was time and I was praying for that, even not know scripture perfectly. and. Read after in Timothy what Paul writes about soldiers and his. Religion. What's your favorite Bible verse? Do you have a favorite? Uh, I don't try make favor, not favor, but I really like read Psalms because David was hard man by God's own heart, and David suffers in Psalms. It's really touch 